Accessories Show, and this is UDI RC's Power Venom RC boat. This is model number UDI001. This thing is small, but it's super fast, super fun, and it's just uh, been a lot of fun to race both these around. Um, recently, we actually went to Toys R Us to get some boats, you know, some full grown men walking into Toys R Us. We won some boats and uh, unfortunately, every single one we got there went like two miles per hour. So uh, those just weren't doing it for us. So I looked into some different ones and I found these. These are the UDI RC Venom and it comes in a few different colors. This one's orange. This one's black, and not to mention, I think they're under $50, so that was a little bit cheaper than we paid uh, even at Toys R Us. But these are a single prop, and just have a look at them here. We got to uh, go ahead and remove the, these do run off battery. They run off a 7.4 volt battery. This one actually doesn't have one in here right now, but each of them, come with a battery and to charge it or actually to turn these on there's no on off switch so you basically put in the battery and then you would turn the transmitter on and then you would connect it and the only way you'll see life from this let's just go ahead I'll turn on the transmitter and plug this guy in and I do want to show you the Okay, the three beeps like that, I want to discuss something about that real quick because this was actually just in water. When you first pull this thing out of the box, you're not going to have any life to this at all until you actually put it into the water. So there's no on-off switch. You simply turn on your transmitter, then turn this thing on, and then put it in the water instantly. As soon as it gets that you know water through that little straw uh, tube right there, it will go doot doot doot, and it's ready to go. However, there was a little bit of water in there from, well, they've just been sitting in here, but now it can haul. And these things do haul. I think uh, they max out around 15 miles per hour and they just skip across, across the water. Earlier I was driving one, it's really windy outside, uh, and I was just hitting waves and I was doing like 360 barrel rolls. And what's really nice about these, check this out. Say if you roll one, let me roll both of them real quick. These have it, so with the transmitter, basically what you do with the transmitter, here's the transmitter right here. You just go like that. So I just went forward and I turned and went back. So let me show you on this one. Just like that. And they're ready to go again. Now, I have actually collided these into each other. It's really fun chasing each other around and just, you know, trying basically we, were, we ramped off and this one went straight down and completely submerged and i was like oh no where'd it go then it surfaced and basically it shoots all the water out of the out of the back and then boom just takes out like like crazy fast so that's basically them let's go talk about some more of the specs like i said you got a 7.4 volt 600 milliamp hour battery uh this will give you about eight minutes of drive time and these things cut sharp i mean you can do it reminds me a lot of like how a jet ski would perform just spinning on the dime and skip in and oh man they're just they're just a lot of fun now the range on this is really good too the range is actually 120 meters so that's 393 feet i haven't topped out the range uh both times i went out one time there was a fisher guy and i didn't want to uh distract him from fishing but um I mean, just the range, I haven't had any problems with them cutting out at all. And another nice feature, when I first started driving these, I didn't even look, but the transmitter has, it will start beeping when the battery gets low. So I know when the, uh, I got to bring it back to shore and that's just awesome. I'm pretty sure uh, most boats should probably do that, but that's just definitely a nice feature. It just starts beeping and I actually drove for about another minute after it started beeping. Uh, just because I was close just to check it out, but uh, if you're beeping, you know, you can get back pretty quickly and uh, go ahead and dock it. Let's talk about the transmitter. Transmitter is a 2.4 gigahertz. It's uh, one of these guys right here. So we do have forward and we also have reverse. And the reverse, it, it works and it goes backwards and you'll probably suck some water into your boat. And after you do that, 
If it starts getting a little low, just floor it and vroom, suck all that water right out of there. But uh, if we turn the wheel right, it will make the rudder go right and then left. And then here are the trims. You can do the steering trims, um, the TH trim. You got the, I think that's the, I'm not exactly sure what those are. But either way, this sucker is quick and it is just a lot of fun. So there you have it. Uh, it does come in a few different colors. Everything you need is included except for four AA batteries. Uh, you'll have to pick some of those up. So, uh, but besides that, everything you need is included. Uh, the charger on this thing is awesome. It's a USB charger, so you have to plug into a USB port. But um, it takes about an hour and a half to, it says 120 minutes to charge. I experienced more around an hour and a half for a full charge. And basically you'll plug it in and the charger will turn red when the battery is completely charged. You'll just go ahead and pull that battery off. You're good to go. So there you have it, the UDI RC Venom RC boat. And that is sold by DT Toys and Games. Thanks for watching.